Okay, for step two, um, I've opened two folders here. The first one is where I got the font, the new font that I want to use. And the second one is, you go into your Kodi, the Kodi folder, you go to add-ons, you go to your skin, and in this case I'm using Knox. You go to fonts, and you copy it over. Okay, so what I like to do is I like to make a separate, um, what I call, like the font set. <clears throat> now, these basically are the names of each of the um, fonts that I'm using, as well as the corresponding number that will go in the strings po. So let's open the strings po first. So if we go here, inside the skin, you're going to go to language. You're going to go to English and you're going to open the strings pole. Now if you scroll down to the bottom, you'll see that I have a bunch of different, um, these are all different uh, fonts that I'm using. So next number in line would be 31980. So let's copy that, paste it in, change that to 80. Now you need to do this in order for um, bad, I'm going to just call it bad, to show up in Kodi when you click on fonts. So we'll save that, and we'll close it. So we've got to remember the number was 80, and we're going to call it bad. Okay, so next up, what we're going to do is I'm just going to grab a one of the font sets that I've already made. And I, I keep these separate because then you can just copy paste whatever ones you want right into the font XML that's in Kodi. So I'm going to open one of these. Okay, actually I'll show you how to make one of these first of all. So if you are here and you go to, um, you want to open the font XML. So the font XML is in 1080i. And font XML. So you open it. I like to shrink these up. As you can see, I have a third one in here. Normally it comes with just default and no two. So all you have to do is copy that. I usually grab from here and copy up, and it'll copy this entire thing, as you can see. But it's just easier if you shrink them up, I find. Okay, so we're going to do Control C to copy. We're going to open a new one, and we're going to paste it in. So up here, we're going to change the name to bad. We're going to change the number to 80. And now what we need to do is we need to go back to the fonts. And we need to grab the name of this. And now because I had grabbed one that was called Bonsai, I'm going to be looking for Bonsai TTF. So what you do is you copy that, or sorry, you just highlight that and hit Control H to get the replace. Paste that in and do a replace all. Now when that's done, I'm going to want to save that, <clears throat> for me anyway, I'm going to save that back in my font sets. Now you can obviously have stuff wherever you want. Now I'll just take that, change it to 80, change it to bad, and save it. Now we're good to go. Now if you want to add this into your Kodi, what you do is just hit Control A and Control C and copy the entire thing, go back to your font sheet. Your font XML, sorry. Hit enter. Add a new line and paste it in. Now, I shrink this up again. See how everything looks normal. So now we have bad <clears throat> in there. 
Okay, so we've added it to the font XML. We've changed the strings po to include for it. And we also slid the font into the font folder. So you need to have those three things done. You need to have this in the in the fonts folder. You need to go to here and add it to the font XML. And you also need to go to languages, English in my case, strings po, and add it here as well. So now once all those things are done, you can open your Kodi. And you can go to System, Interface, and Default, and now you'll see BAD is there. Now, I already had BAD because I was, oh wait, no I don't, this is a different one. Anyway, so now you'll see BAD is there. So you hit Enter, and there you go. Now, a lot of times, some of these um, fonts will be way too big. This one's not too bad, actually. I kind of like it. But you can also change the size of it, and I'm going to show you how in a second, in part three. Okay, so now you know how to load it in.